So now, in the last video, we looked at using the transistor to pass a certain amount of current. Ultimately, we also had a resistor, and based on the current, we gave the base of the transistor. It's a PNP type transistor, 2N2907. And based on the current, we gave the base of the transistor, and that would go to the emitter. There's a diode drop, though, to be aware of but we would get a multiple amount of current through the transistor even if we added a resistor. So this video, we're doing something different. So right now, instead of just passing current through the transistor, it's actually off right now. We have the resistor here to the negative rail. It comes there, it comes to the LED, and since the LED is lit, the short lead, the cathode, is to the jumper there. Long lead, the anode, is up one row. and up that one row we go to the positive side of the power supply so we have a current path through there because the transistor is off right now so what we're gonna do we're gonna make a not gate so right now the LED is on this is considered our output since it's a PNP it's a negative output and uh, going to positive the LED is on so right now our load is on we can take a 10 kilo ohm resistor needs to be somewhat low 10 kilo ohms is uh, not terribly low but it's somewhat low and we got to put it to the negative rail now you see the LED goes off and that is because as a not gate generally what uh, you see is that the transistor now is it's functioning as a switch right now it's on it goes directly to the positive rail there and so that was the destination for the current going or electron flow in this case going through the LED now it's a much easier path because the transistor is conducting so well that's why we need to use a somewhat low value of resistance this is enough because the LED is off so this is conducting basically like a piece of wire so we have the collector up there basically connected directly to the emitter or to yeah to the emitter which goes to the positive rail so it's easier to go that way than to go through the LED so let's uh, that's the 10 kilo ohm resistor this is the 100 kilo ohm resistor we used earlier let's put that to the negative rail and now you can see the transistor is letting through some current, but uh, it's still blocking enough where there's a path for it's easier for it to go through the LED than the transistor. So they're sharing the current right now, but we use a low enough value resistor. Now there's enough current going through the base to emitter to allow a multiple and enough currents being stolen that there's uh, no voltage build up across the LED so that it can pass current of course if we go to the positive rail that just holds the transistor off even more so it has to be the right polarity you have to have at least 0.6 volts before current will flow and then after that the amount of resistance since this power supply does not limit current the uh, amount of resistance limits current so in any case I just had a question about another video I did on the uh, not gate and so I thought I would take this opportunity since I was going to do a PNP transistor video anyways to show its version of the not gate so right now the, the uh, PNP transistor is not conducting currents freely flowing through the LED based on the resistance that we set and the 5 volts plus the LED voltage drop and now we're stealing that energy so why would it go through the LED when now it's directly connected to the positive rail this way there's no reason so the voltage drops to nothing at that point all the voltage is going across this resistor and uh, going to the positive rail there's no way for voltage to build up across there so those are topics I covered in a lot of other videos so I'm just kinda making this a quick demonstration to help uh, reinforce that so Look for my other videos, I made diagrams and stuff where I went into more detail on it. 
but I think a lot of people like just these brief demonstration videos. That's why I've been making so many. So thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.